what's up guys time to go back with a video you already know what i'm saying and all right guys Ooh, we got a spirit we got a special one i don't know no. what i'll be doing yo <laughs> got a special video today guys we're gonna be talking about the top 10 greatest players of all time you already know what i'm saying so let's begin Start out as number 10, Wilt Chamberlain. Okay, guys, I'm going to be honest with you. I don't know a lot about Wilt Chamberlain. I'm sorry. I know that he scored um, 100 points in a game, and um, he had a lot of good stats. But, yeah, I think he has one championship. I think just one. Yeah. So, number nine is going to be... Larry Bird. Kaka! You know what I'm saying, yo. So yes, yeah, so Larry Bird will be number nine. Um, again, wasn't born during this time. Larry Bird was a great small forward. He is the second greatest small forward of all time. The other, the greatest small forward of all time will be higher on the list. You know what I'm saying? Um, I think he won the first three-point contest. At a, the All-Star game, I'm not 100% for sure on that. You might want to Google that. I really don't know, but yeah. And he was, a, he was I think, the, um, one of the only teams that really beat the Lakers and the finals, the Showtime Lakers, so yeah. But number eight will be Shaquille O'Neal, one of the most dominant players that's ever played the game, yo. Shaquille O'Neal has four championships, three Back to back to back, three Pete with the Lakers. Lost the fourth championship to the Detroit Pistons. Then he went to Miami, won a championship with the young D Wade. Um, again, when I started watching basketball, I caught the tail end of his career. I caught when he was on the Cleveland Cavaliers and Boston Celtics. I think maybe I watched a few games when he was on the Phoenix Suns. I actually got a Phoenix Suns jersey of Shaquille O'Neal's on. I can't find it. It's somewhere in my closet. I, if I if I had it, I would show you guys, but it's somewhere. But yeah, Shaquille O'Neal, my favorite center of all time. Most dominant center I've ever seen playing the game of basketball. But number seven will be Timmy D. Tim Duncan. Mr. Fundamental himself. Tim Duncan. Very, he used that glass. Banky, you know what I'm saying, bro? Like, you know Jester's backboard cheese? Tim Duncan never needed that. He could just get that little backboard bank. You know what I'm saying, yo? He got so much bank. He got big, a lot of wallet. Okay, yo, I'm thinking a little too far. But Tim Duncan is the seventh greatest player of all time, and he doesn't get a lot of respect. So, respect Tim Duncan. I'm not Duncan. Duncan. <sighs> I really need to go back to school. All right, so I might get a little hate for this, but number six will be Magic Irving. Johnson, five chips, one of, if not, no, he is the greatest point guard of all time. We are, we are, we already know, okay? Showtime. The crazy assist we've ever seen in basketball has came from Magic Johnson. He literally put the Magic in Johnson. I don't even know if that makes any sense, but I'm gonna just say it. <laughs> Number five is gonna be second favorite player of all time. Rest in peace, Kobe. Kobe Bryant is the fifth best player of all time. And he is the best Laker of all time. I would say Kareem, but Kareem hasn't played his whole career with the Lakers. So I will say Kobe Bryant is the greatest Laker that's ever played basketball. Hey, bye. I'm gonna leave that alone. But um, Kobe Bryant is the fifth greatest player of all time. We, I don't think we give a lot of respect to Kobe for some reason. Like, People put him like at number nine. I'm like, what are you doing? Kobe's the top five player that's ever played. He's number four in scoring because LeBron just passed him a couple months ago. He's number four in scoring and has five championships. Come on. Come on. I mean, I've never seen a score like Kobe. I was watching Kobe clips a couple nights ago. I mean, like, he's hitting tough fadeaways. He's hitting shots with Shane Battier and his face like this. Who makes that? I can feel the heat from my hand. 
How is that possible? I don't even know. It's Kobe freaking Bryant, okay? All right, guys, I actually forgot to talk about number four. It's Bill Russell. Bill Russell is the fourth greatest player of all time. Um, he has 11 championships, and he won eight championships in a row. And he beat Will Chamberlain in all those championships. So, yeah, sorry I forgot. Now, number three, my favorite player of all time. He is now a Laker for the second year. You know what I'm saying? We're trying to go for that chip this year. Hopefully, the um, NBA resumes will be LeBron James. Come on. He can pass like magic. He can score it like, I don't think, not a lot of people say this, but Shaq and, and, and uh, Michael Jordan. Because he has that relit, relit. This is getting ridiculous. I might consider going back to school. Like, I can't talk, bro. But you know what I'm saying. He can get to the basket with ease. He can do it all game. Come on. And um, he can score it like Jordan. Like he, he when I jump shot going, it's over straight up. You see what happened in Toronto with the fadeaways, okay? You y'all seen it, okay? But number two is gonna be, it's gonna be Air Jordan, Michael Jordan, okay? I'll put Michael over LeBron. I, I will be truthful. I will put Michael Jordan over LeBron. Because of course, Michael Jordan 6-0 in the finals. I mean, you can't dispute that or nothing. I mean, Michael Jordan made basketball what it is today. Who, all the, all the guys that play in the league right now has looked up to Michael Jordan. Look, all the greats, you know, Durant, LeBron, Kobe, you know, everybody that's been great after Michael Jordan's played, it's all looked up to Michael Jordan. So, I'm just saying. But number one would be the Skyhook himself, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. Guys, like I said in the other video, um, whenever y'all see it, about me saying why Michael Jordan is not the GOAT, I'll put, I'll, put, I'll put the little card up here, you know what I'm saying? Or up here, wherever it's gonna be. Yeah, <laughs> but... My, I mean, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar is the greatest scorer of all time. I mean, he has the most points uh, scored in the whole career. He's the all-time leading scorer. Come on, man. He has six championships. Come on. He's dominated the league. He's dominated college. He's dominated high school. When he's touched the basketball, he has dominated the sport. Come on. To me, there's no question, but hey, we'll just debate. <laughs> but anyways, guys, hey. Put in the comments below, who do you think is in the top 10, or oh, if y'all want to do top 5, top 3, whatever y'all want to do in the comments below. And make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. Leave a comment and do, you already know what to do. Join the crew, become a GOAT. Peace out.